I was in Banaras at that time when Srila Prabhupada was touring, traveling India with his 40 disciples. The, I read in a newspaper, in America, Krishna Bhakti is priest. Naturally, I was devotee of Krishna, so I liked this topic. So <clears throat> I went there. Then there was a procession from the Sasmed Ghat to Tapan Misra's house that is now in Banaras. And when procession finished, I approached Susila Prabhupada and I spoke in Hindi. Bhagavan, up Cobb, America, guys. When you went to America, and how you preach? <laughs> the Prabhupada said, "You see, I just chant Hare Krishna and give some lecture." He said, "They need this Vedic knowledge, so just see how they are happy and they are chanting." Then I asked. Where is your program after Banaras? The Prabhupada said, I will go to Gorakhpur. So I wrote down the date. Then I went to Gorakhpur and Prabhupada was there. He was staying in Krishna Niketan. I went there. I was waiting. And Prabhupada was at that time alone. So I did not recognize that he is Prabhupada. Where is uh, A.C. Bhaktivedan Swami? I asked Prabhupada. <laughs> so Prabhupada asked me, why you want to meet with him? So I replied, because he is my guru. I like him very much. So Prabhupada asked me, why you accept him as your guru? So I said, because he is the servant of Satan Mahaprabhu. Then Prabhupada asked me, who is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu? So I said, he is Krishna himself. So I was talking and Prabhupada asked, why you accept Lord Chaitanya as Krishna? Because I read Chaitanya Charitamrit, Krishna himself came as a devotee to preach. <laughs> then, then, then Prabhupada said, no, 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 he is not Krishna. He is devotee of Krishna. I said, no, he is Krishna himself. The Prabhupada said, insisted, no, he is devotee of Krishna. He is not Krishna. Then I, I spoke very hard words to Srila Prabhupada. I, I said, was chupra, he just keep quiet, don't speak anymore. Oh. <laughs> then Prabhupada laughed very loudly. <laughs> Very loudly he was laughing. Laughing. Then some bhaktas came and they were offering obeisances. So I realized that he is Guru Maharaj, he is Sila Prabhupada. So when they offered obeisances, I also offered obeisances. And so I said, Please forgive me. I offended at your lotus feet. I did not recognize you. Please forgive me. Then Prabhupada caught my hand like this and come to my room. Then uh, three disciples were sitting there. And Prabhupada was laughing, laughing. His smile was not uh, stopped. And then he told that he, he knows that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is Krishna himself. So he said, you chastised me, I like that. <laughs> I am very happy with your words.